All right, beautiful people. I'm going to show you uh, the jungle real quick before I go chopping tops off like these. See, I've already chopped a bunch off. No bull why you do this every week. Because I'm not chopping enough off the first time. Because I'm a scaredy cat. It's hard chopping on the plants, but it's a full greenhouse. Let's wish me luck on uh, bud rot this year. I'll keep you guys updated. I did not. Yeah, I knew plants grow fast, but yeah, it's my first outdoor grow. But these are too tall, way too tall. I gotta chop, because if not, then they'll be hitting this ceiling, and the ceiling up here holds water. I got fans in here, but I'll definitely keep you guys updated on if I get a bunch of bud rod or not. And all I'm doing every time I cut these darn things, I just get more branches, of course. So. Alright. But I gotta come through here like all these. Wow, just a few days ago. I, see, it's all up on the greenhouse. I gotta chop all that out. And it. And I literally chop, come in, chop, almost fail. Can't see shit. Like, uh, but I'll let you see what underneath them look like. But I still yet got to come through and defoliate again and again. But see, we're in the start of flower. They're all flowering at their own pace because there's four different strains, seven plants in here, four on one side, four on the other. But eventually I'm not going to be able to walk through here, so I don't know. I don't know what to do, but this is my first outdoor grow. Thought I would um, show it, I would say show it off, but five foot wide plants and an eight foot greenhouse that's would have been well over eight foot if I didn't chop on them every week. But as you can see, I got landscape fabric down to help with the weeds. But these the tree trunks. Yep, yep. But I'm getting ready to spray, so you guys stay lifted, stay blessed, stay well medicated. <laughs>